Okay, I'm going to show you how to set up MMS and internet settings for an HTC 8X running on T-Mobile's network. Um, this phone is actually better than the uh, T-Mobile one because it has LTE and it uses the same bands as T-Mobile. So I've been getting LTE on, on the phone and with the revamping of that 1700 to 1900 megahertz band or the other way around, um, your HSPA should be pretty quick. First of all, you're going to go to settings. You're going to go to cellular. And the first um, area you're going to go on is edit internet APNs. I already have mine entered, so I'm not going to re-enter them. It's just one simple entry. So here's where you put in your... Let me see. The light is kind of messed up. It won't let me focus. Um, you're going to put in your fast.t-mobile.com. Everything else gets left blank except the IP type. Then you're going to hit save. Next setting is your edit MMS APN. One thing I learned with this, if you insert an AT&T SIM card and you connect to AT&T and then remove that and put a T-Mobile SIM card, these settings will most likely not work and you have to do a, a hard reset. <coughs> now you're going to go into edit MMS APNs and this is the other settings that you need to put in if I could focus in on this um, under the APN same thing you're gonna put fast that t dash mobile dot com and the dash is important otherwise it won't work for some reason it doesn't want to focus um, you're gonna leave everything else blank except the MMS URL which is important and I'll list that below. Here it is. Um, it ends in MMS slash WAP ENC. Here's the whole thing. I'll write it down at the bottom. And then also your port is port 80. Once you're done with that, um, here you go again. Uh, you're going to hit save and you should be able to get on the internet without any problems. I'll put in a new website, cnbc.com. And the speed is pretty quick considering, you know, you're using T-Mobile network and this is an AT&T phone, but the LTE bands are the same. Um, keep in mind, again, if you change a SIM card to AT&T, you may have to do a hard reset um, in order to put the T-Mobile settings. And here it is. The phone is running on T-Mobile. Wow, the focus is so hard to do. There you go. Okay, good luck. And the phone works pretty good on, on T-Mobile. And it's got the LTE built in.